We have 21 news stories on site now. What's on site? Warrington bounced back from their Wembley hangover just five days later with a riveting display against LFC last night. Read our report here. Warrington coach Steve Price was pleased with the attitude of his players after a tough five days. LFC coach Lee Radford said some of his players didn't look bothered in their record defeat at Warrington. St. Helens coach Justin Holbrook said it is a shame that Alex Walmsley will not get to play again this year. James Green has signed a new one-year deal with Bradford. The latest stat attack feature is out now. You will be surprised at some of the stats from Round 2 of the Super 8s. Wigan coach Sean Wayne thinks Captain Sean O'Loughlin could be the key to them beating St. Helens. Witness will welcome Tom Gilmore back for their qualifiers clash against Toulouse on Saturday. They have announced their 19-man squad. Leeds will welcome back a key trio on Saturday, while Maurice Blair and Justin Carney will return for Hull KR. The 19-man squads have been confirmed. Luke Gale and Ben Roberts will return for Castleford on Saturday, while 13 players who featured in Catalan's Cup win could play. The 19-man squads have been revealed. The latest Love Rugby League Weekly is out now. Host Dave Parkinson is joined by editor James Gordon and reporter Drew Darbisher to react to the Challenge Cup final and look ahead to this weekend's Action Super League pod predictions, in association with Love Rugby League. This week looked ahead to Round 3 of the Super 8s in both Super League and the qualifiers. Huntslip captain Dwayne Strawier has signed a new two-year deal at the South Leeds Stadium. One of the men behind the ambitious Red Star Belgrade Rugby League Club has been appointed an independent director of the Rugby League European Federation. The latest paper talk feature is out now. There's a big rugby league story breaking in the national newspapers. France coach Aurelien Coloni has named a 28-man training squad for their internationals this autumn. Hull forwards Chris Green and Mark Munique Yellow have been ruled out for the rest of the season through injury. Securing the league lead as shield and extra derby incentive for St. Helens says Morgan Knowles. Luke Gale is set to return from his long injury layoff when Castleford host Catalans on Saturday night. Man of Steel favorite Ben Barba is set to leave St. Helens for North Queensland Cowboys at the end of the season, according to reports down under. Challenge Cup winners Catalans Dragons will receive a visit from the President of the Government of Catalonia on Friday. What's in the paper Swarringdon's Bryson Goodwin racks up five tries in Hull FC thrashing, report The Guardian. Sean Wayne plays video games ahead of Wigan trip to St. Helens, report Wigan today. Ben Barba to sign for NRL club North Queensland Cowboys, report St. Helens star. Injury update on Chris Hill, Ben Murdoch Masilla and Bodine Thompson, report Warrington Guardian. Wade Deacon's Wembley win is a boost for Rugby League and Witness Report Roundcorn and Witness World. Tim Sheens accepts pressure and expectation heavier on his Hull KR side, reports Hull Daily Mail. Lee Radford says Hull FC facing longest five weeks of their lives as coach hits out a team's effort, reports Hull Daily Mail. Callum McClellan happy to be at home in Headingley, report Yorkshire Evening Post. What's on social? He is climbing the leaderboards. Josh Charnley has moved ahead of Kirk Yeaman into standalone 10th place in the list of Super League's all time leading try scorers. Clapping hands 160 tries. Good and tonight's smirking face here from tonight's man of the match following the Wire's emphatic win over Hellpick.twitter.com slash Agnan H. Sneef, Warrington Wolves, at Wolvesville, August 30, 2018. Good on Scott Taylor for fronting up after Hell FC's huge defeat. Scott Taylor spoke with FC Live after tonight's game with the Warrington Wolves. Pick.twitter.com slash x Oxt, Hull FC, at Hull Official, August 30, 2018 A legend of the sport, farewell JT, we will miss you crying face, thanks for the memories. The latest Sport at 6 podcast by BBC Radio Manchester's Jack Dearden and Trevor Hunt is available to download now. 
The latest rugby league show on Proper Sport is available to download now. The latest Whippets and Flat Caps podcast is available to download now, presented by John Wilkin and Mark Flanagan. The latest Five Live Rugby League podcast is available to download now, presented by Dave Woods. The final Hooter podcast by Love Rugby League's Dave Parkinson and Adrian Jackson is now available to download.